Hi guys, I present to you the crush song Boku no Hero Baku Deku version. There's an intro as to why the song is being sang featuring the Baka Squad, and then we have a beautiful rendition of the crush song by Deku. Please enjoy, subscribe and comment. Thank you. So that's basically what happened, Baku Go. Let me get this straight. You mean to tell me that you stupid hair, the electric dunce and Deku are fighting against a villain, and that the villain's quirk makes someone lose all inhibitions, and that that nerd got hit by the quirk, so he's out of control, yup, the villain shot his quirk to me but Midoriya stepped in front of me, to protect me, of course that nerd would do that, he didn't even know what the quirk was, of course he didn't, it could have been a death ray, bummer it didn't hit you then. You're so mean how can you be so mean after all these years you don't even care if I'm a gonna faces. Anyway Deku is a true hero emotional faces. So brave. So manly super emotional he is so awesome faces. What a great boyfriend heart eyed faces. You mean my boyfriend pink hair. Yes of course. The ultimate ship super shipping heart. What is this chick talking about? No idea. Anyway. The effects should last him a whole day. He's locked in his house but he has his phone so he might try to reach you. You'll take me for a wimp who can't even take care of that stupid nerd? Of course not. But I've been with him for the past few hours. Be warned. Be really warned. Please. What's the wildest thing he could do without inhibitions? He'll probably roleplay his favorite heroes for the whole day. I hope that's all he does face. At least you can handle him. I don't know what Jirao would have done if that Ray had hit me. Probably dump me. She'll probably dump you anyway. I'd say something but since Deku saved my relationship I'll keep my mouth shut you mean person face. Good luck. Whatever. Deku's harmless to me. You just go on thinking that happy hell is coming your way faces. Hush hush hush. What? Blush blush blush. The hell? You are now my big fat crush. Alright. The inhibition thing. Okay. Let's see what you got nerd. I'm single as I can be. No you're not. You're single. I'm your boyfriend you dumpsh. Perfect for me. Damn right I am. I'm gonna give you a bunch of reasons why you should date me. I'm already dating you. We've been dating for 2 years. Reason number 1. I'm super hot. Yes. Reason number 2. She's super not. Is this what you've been doing with your uninhibited time? Doodling Sean Floaty? I don't even like chicks. Reason number 3. I'm all you got. Pretty sure stupid hair digs me. And all you got is someone hot. Oh I. This is getting annoying. Boy. Check my resume. Oh I. Why is I see hot in there? Good lover? You want a background check? Okay. You are not answering. First name hot. And last name beach. Hahaha <laughs> you can't even swear when you're uninhibited. But if your last name's B word, your first name is my. Wanna get with me? Yes. Now that's the sitch. You think I'm trash? Right now you're not at your best. No. Hell no. I'm class. And I got a big fat ash. You're an attempt me? And all I got to say is. This is annoying. Dot dot dot. Please date me. I already do. Told ya. Because I'm single. Don't you even think about telling that to Icy Hot you delusional nerd. S-I-N-G-L-E I know how it's spelled. Love me. I do. And hug me. Okay. And touch me. Well this is getting interesting. And. Well. Fork me. Bold of you to just invite me over like that in your unswearing language. You know. You're annoying. But it's not so bad. It's not disgusting to see you being so bold for a change. Two minutes later. Hush hush hush. What? Blush blush blush. No. You are now my big fat crush. Not again. Indeed. Soon Bakugo regretted his previous words. For Izuku began to text the same string of messages in a loop. And when Bakugo started ignoring his messages. Izuku began to call him and sing him the song. And when Bakugo blocked Izuku's number. Izuku escaped from his house and went over to Bakugo's apartment to sing and dance the song while throwing himself at him. Ah, yes, Bakugo really did regret his words, and after Izuku fell asleep after all the singing and dancing, Bakugo sent one last message, 3.30am, it should have been you, 10.30am of the next morning, what, 